All right, so this video is going to be about something that actually just happened to me, like, I don't know, like an hour ago. So I was sitting downstairs and I was like, oh, okay, um, it's getting to like three o'clock and I should probably go take a shower now. So I grabbed a cookie because I was like starving. I went upstairs and I reached over to turn on the faucet for the shower because I turn it on first and then I get ready to get in the shower. So I reach over, I have my cookie in my mouth, I reach over, turn on the faucet, and my cookie freaking falls into the tub, pissed. I didn't even know what to do. I was enjoying that cookie, and now it is gone. It's in the tub, well I got it out of the tub. It was in the tub, it was soggy, and it was, no, it is not okay. And I just, I couldn't stand it. I wanted to go run around screaming around my neighborhood, but I looked like crap, because I hadn't taken a shower yet. And I don't know anyone in this neighborhood. I don't like my neighbors because they reported my dogs for barking too much when my dogs don't barely ever bark. Unless the doorbell rings, which every dog barks when the doorbell rings. Neighbors. Anyway, back to my cookie. I was very pissed off. I wanted to enjoy that cookie. I have more, but I wanted to enjoy that one. And I didn't. I didn't get to enjoy my cookie. And I wanted to enjoy my cookie, but I didn't get to. I just wanted to enjoy my cookie. And then the bathtub had to go and steal it from me. It's like I was reaching over it and the faucet just went Kah! and knocked it right out of my mouth. The little devilish cookie stealing bathtub should be like a children's scary story. The bathtub that knocks cookies out of people's mouths. So, to clear up anyone who saw my Facebook status, no, I was not eaten while I was in the bathtub. That's weird. I wouldn't do that. One, because I don't take baths. Because you're basically washing yourself in your own filth. And two, then you're going to get crumbs all up in the bathtub, which makes it more filthy, which you're just going to be wiping all the cookie crumbs right on you, too. I mean, that's just dumb. I just don't understand it. It's... I don't... I don't even know anyone who would ever eat in the bathtub. That's just weird. Like, what? I don't... I don't understand. But there are some people in the world that would probably eat in the bathtub. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, you know, I think I should have like a ceremony, like a funeral for that cookie, even though it's already in the trash can and it's like broken into soggy wet pieces. Soggy. It's like luke, lukewarm. That just doesn't sound good. It's like why would you want to take a, a dip in a lukewarm pool? That sounds nice. No, no it does not. It does not sound nice. It sounds like a load of bull, is what it sounds like. Because I would never... <sighs> this is not okay. Anyway, if I had grass and dirt in my backyard, then I would bury it back there right now. But I don't, because I live in Arizona, where they don't believe in that, unless it's in the desert. Like the actual desert where like the cactuses are. But no, they believe in rock rock land because they don't have grass here because it'll die too quickly even though there is such a thing as fake grass that looks real so people of Arizona think about that but no we have rocks and ugly ass plants they're disgusting like each one of them looks like it's gonna just slice my leg open and I'm just gonna bleed everywhere and it's just gonna be everywhere it's not gonna be okay It'll probably hurt a little bit too. I don't want to be hurt. I just. 
I'll just pretend. Maybe I'll have a dream tonight about burying my cookie, and that'll be like my funeral. Because, one, it's too hot outside to go digging around in rocks to bury a cookie. Did you know they actually have, like, people that they hire in Arizona to rake your rocks? What? Oh, I'm gonna pay you, we paid them like 70 bucks when we first moved here, and then my dad was like, no, I don't want you freaking raking my rocks for 70 bucks. I'm not even gonna rake my own rocks for 70 bucks. I'm not even gonna rake the rocks for... There's no point. They're just rocks. They don't matter. They're just there. They're not like plants. Plants are living things. Rocks are not. They are fragments of bigger rocks. It's dumb. This is why I don't like it here. Because they just, they're just weird. They have rocks and no grass and it's hot in fall. I know it's hot in my hometown right now too, but it's just too much here. It's always hot. It's never cool. I don't like it. I want to go home. Yeah. Those of you that did see my Glee Project uh, audition video rant, I did take that off because I didn't want it to jeopardize my chances of getting on the show. Even though it was not directed towards Glee, it was just directed towards the fact that my video would not upload. And it, had, it was something weird, like it was, my recordings were just like, they were online instead of me doing them on my own computer. So it was just like, wasn't accepting them. but. It was just like a funny rant, but I didn't want to jeopardize my chances, so I took it off so that just in case um, my chances wouldn't like be thrown off the boat because I want to have an equal chance like everyone else. So if you did see that video that's and you saw that it's gone, that is why it's not there anymore.